Hi guys, welcome to Simple Programming. In this video, let us see the importance of other rate of JSON format and how it makes life easy when you use format for date. So for this example, let me introduce a new variable in our student object. I'm going to introduce a timestamp here, which is going to be of type date. So in the controller, what I'm going to do is I'm going to simply set a date here. So let me quickly start the server. The server is up. Let's go on to the postman and let's fire a request. So the request has a new date in it. So what about formatting? Now what will, how will you do formatting? In a regular case, you'll be using simple date format. You'll give the format there, then you'll convert it into a different the format and then you will set the value in this set timestamp. What if there is a better way to do it and an easy way to do it? So JSON gives you an option to do that. So it has a annotation called JSON format where you can directly introduce the format option for your date. So shape is nothing but an enum which is going to define the type of the uh, the variable. So it's going to be a you know the type the type of the format is going to be string and then the pattern is going to be let's say it's going to be dd mm yy h hours minutes and seconds a simple date format now. So let me stop the server and let me run it again. Okay, the server is up. So in a previous example, we got the raw date time. So in this example, when I click on send, we got the timestamp in the defined format, the format that we gave with the help of other rate of JSON format. So now do you see how easy it is to define formats for your dates with the help of other rate of JSON format? I hope you really like this video guys. Please subscribe for more such videos. Thank you.